buddy. Why are those baby taros making such a ruckus? Their parents flew away to gather food. But without the light from the moon lilies, the pterosaur flock can't find their way home. When Clara picked those flowers, she had no idea how it would affect the natural world of Compi Valley and the baby pterosaurs. But she does now. No! no! The flock is coming back! But there's no light. They can't see where to go. Don't worry. There's always a way to help dinosaurs in need. If I could just think of something. <laughs> Blow jars! Yes! Thanks, Tango! Great idea! <laughs> Tara, can you and Wilbur fly to the ranch? We need to get all the glow jars you can carry. Sure can! Come on, Wilbur! Giddy up, up, and away! Are these gonna be enough? Yup, that'll do it. Come on. Dino, Dino Rangers, Rangers, ride! ride! Have some moon lily seeds right here. Sure would be nice if y'all could help us plant them. Thank you, ma'am. We'd be glad to help. Well, I'll be a Compi's uncle. Who would have thought Clara would offer to help for once? Wait, we're doing a nice thing, Clara? Yeah, and maybe we might accidentally plant a few moon lilies at our place, too. And, and we, we can, can come along to help you, Clara. Clara. Yeah so you don't have to accidentally plant them. After all the trouble they caused, the Tin Horns learned that they should have left the moon lilies where they found them. But in the same way that nature is full of surprises, it turns out the Tin Horns are too. Now we don't have any lilies for the Brontosaurus. We'll find some more. Yeah, we can follow the compi. Looks like we just missed our chance. And now it's dark. We're never gonna find the moon lilies. <sighs> moon lilies. Why are they called moon lilies? Wait! Moonlight. It makes the moon lilies glow. I've got an idea. Follow me. Min, what are we doing? We're back where we started. Which is the best place to find them. Just wait and see. Come on, clouds. You can only see them in the moonlight. No wonder Ma couldn't find them. Come on, Dino Ranchers. Let's ride. Yeehaw! What is that? I wasn't so sure, but we never gave up. Here you go, Mama. Eat these. They'll make you feel better.
Spookosaurus, it is real! Ah! 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 Spookosaurus is real! Just like Pa's story! I didn't want to believe it! John, you were scared too? I'm not scared. I'm just thinking about the glowing river and the fire-filled trees and the howling cave and the spooky shadow and... Okay, I might be scared. I... I didn't want you to know. I was trying to be brave. Well, John, if spending the night chasing after a helpless dinosaur when you're scared isn't brave, then I don't know what is. Besides, you've been helping us be brave all night. And now it's our turn to help you. You're right. Let's go save that dino. It's okay. We've got this. That's not a spookosaurus. <gasps> it's the baby stego that ran off earlier. And that must be its mother. It was a cry for help. <laughs> the glow jar is making shadow puppets appear, just like Pa did. Hmm. And the cave makes the baby's roar sound spookier than it really is. You were just howling because you got your foot stuck in this rock, weren't you? <laughs> <sighs> I guess the Spookosaurus wasn't real after all. <laughs> <laughs>